Welcome to the overview of video production. This video outlines the positions of a game day control room and the basics of creating an engaging video board show. A control room often has multiple positions that work together to create a show. The director is in charge of instructing camera, replay, and graphic operators while putting together the live show. The director is responsible for speaking on headset to ensure everyone knows how the show should look. The technical director, or TD, works closely with the director to execute the changing of what viewers see on the screen. Using a production switcher, such as a TriCaster, the technical director listens to the director's instructions on which camera, replay, or video to use and has control over what goes out live to the viewers. A replay operator uses replay equipment such as a 3Play or EVS to create instant replay footage to show during live game action. The replay operator is in charge of creating replay clips of a particular play or portion of the game to show again and playing those clips at the order of the director. A replay operator may also work on showing game highlights such as a halftime or a post-game highlight reel. The producer oversees all the control room positions and focuses on the timing aspect of the production. Precise timing is critical to hold viewers' attention and to fit the elements within the breaks of the game action. Depending on the production needs, some of these positions may be combined or additional positions may exist. It's not uncommon for smaller productions to combine the two director roles or larger productions to add secondary producers or dedicated equipment operators. When creating a video production, there's a specific method to assembling a show. A typical production switcher features two lines of buttons, or buses, identified as program and preview. The program buttons allow the technical director to send a specific camera or other source to the program feed, which is the live output to the display or to air. The preview buttons connect to an independent preview monitor. Typically, a TD will place a source into preview, then use either a cut or a transition effect to switch it into the program output for the viewers to see. Most production crews use headsets to communicate. The director uses commonly accepted phrases to communicate with the camera operators and other crew during the show. The director will first give a ready command. When the director is going to come to a camera next, they will say, ready camera two. For the camera operator, this means to hold the shot steady. For the TD, this means to place this camera into preview. When the director is ready to take the camera live, they will give a take command. This tells the TD to take the camera into program and for the camera operator, it means their camera is live for the viewers to see. For a replay operator, the director will tell them when to be ready with a replay and when to roll it so they can time the replay properly in between the live camera shots. Ready replay and roll replay, or simply roll, are typical commands given to the replay operator. A replay operator is expected to inform the director how much time is left in a replay clip in order for the TD to transition out of the clip before it ends. When the clip has 10 seconds left, simply say 10. Once the clip is below 5 seconds, a replay operator should count down the final seconds of the clip. This informs the director that the clip is nearly over and to transition to the next shot. Because a production involves several people and multiple moving parts, it's important to have a clear idea of how the show will look prior to the event. To achieve this, a producer often puts together a game day script or rundown to outline the order of the show. This outline usually details the name of the features, source for audio and video, along with timing for each segment. Using a script or outline, keeps everyone on the production on the same page for putting together a successful event. This concludes the overview of video production. Continue to other videos to learn more about your Dactronics control system.